All right, guys, welcome back to some more of The Last of Us Part 2. We are on to part number 14 now already. Uh, at this point of the first game, we were nearly done. I think I played The Last of Us 1 in 15 parts. So I imagine we're just over the halfway mark in this game. Uh, maybe a little bit further than that, actually. But uh, some people commented saying the game is about 25 hours long. So we should be just over halfway through, I think. But uh, yeah, I've had a lot of fun with this series. In the last episode, we did manage to find Nora. Ellie questioned her and beat her quite badly to get the answers that uh, that she needed. But uh, Nora made a big mistake. She spoke of Joel's death and how I think she called him a little bitch and that he deserved it. So I said it at the time. That was a that was a bad move. That was a very stupid, stupid thing to say, to Ellie. But uh, yeah, hope you've been enjoying it so far. Thank you for stopping by, I really appreciate it. Make sure to hit the like button down below. It only takes a split second and really helps me out. And uh, subscribe as well if you're not subscribed to the channel already. But yeah, with that being said, uh, let's jump back into it. All right, so I actually had to close my PlayStation 5 down altogether there. The game, once again, I mentioned it in previous parts. This game has appeared very laggy at times and that time the screen just completely froze. So. I'm hoping it's going to load up this time and be alright because that was weird what happened there. It was lagging so much it was beyond belief. But I've never, I was a little bit worried a few parts ago when I mentioned it for the first time that it could be my PS5. But I've been playing games over the last few days and stuff like that and it, uh, it hasn't happened. I haven't seen it happen in any other game. So it just appears to be this game for some reason. But hopefully it'll be alright. PlayStation completely froze, but I don't know if I actually opened this gate again. I did open it in the last part, but this is where we ended okay. it off. The fingers crossed the game will play okay because, yeah, I don't think my PS5 has ever froze like it did there. I know this is a PS4 game, but I've played lots of PS4 games on the PlayStation 5 since I got it a year and a half ago, so. Shouldn't really be a problem with it. Let's get going. Almost there. Right, so we're trying to get to that Ferris wheel. We're nearly there. This joke doesn't seem to be moving fast at all. Once again, I hope that's not the game acting up, but. Maybe it's just because we're driving into rough water. Yeah, looks like we can sneak through here, hopefully get around to the Ferris wheel. But I, I've mentioned it pretty much every part at the beginning since I would say the eight or ninth part that I hope we see Tommy or Tommy or uh, Abby in the coming part, and I'm hoping that today is that day. But I'm gonna I'm gonna keep saying it regardless. It's not the game acting up. It's the, it's the, uh, it's the bone itself. Oh shit! I have to do a bit of swimming by the look of it. There not be any sharks in these water. In these waters. Fuck it! I can make it. Oh shit! Yeah. this was the first game we'd be screwed because Ellie couldn't swim in the first game. Joel must have had to teach her. Let's do this. This is almost, uh, <coughs> excuse me, Shades of Uncharted 4 here. I think chapter 13 it is in Uncharted 4 Marooned. After the boat crashes you, 
you wash up on an island. This has a very similar vibe to it. Only there was no infected humans in the Uncharted series, so that adds a little bit more to this. <laughs> Ferris wheel is just over there. Okay. Abby, where are you? Here we go. <laughs> I mentioned, is there any sharks in the water? I didn't expect to find one in the building. <clears throat> Alright, we better go inside. This is spooky in here to say the least. I'm just waiting for something to jump out at me. went around in a circle. I said it was spooky. It doesn't help when you hear sounds like that either. Is it something to do with this? Door? No. Looks like it's just a sliding door or something, but doesn't seem to want to let me out. There must be something around here I'm missing. I presume we can't smash these windows to get out. It wouldn't get us anywhere anyway, I don't think. glass there. <laughs> I did not notice that. I thought every bit had glass, so. What is all this stuff? There better not be a bloater in here. I don't I think the shamblers are fairly, you can deal with them pretty easily, but we had a bloater at the end of the last part. And I don't want to see any more of them. Enough of them.
Alright, so far so good. I just don't think that's gonna stay that way for much longer. There's no way in a big place like this that there's not a... There's not somebody or something in here. Is there? Where the fuck are you? the button locked. Yeah. Smash this so surely. Oh, we can't. Don't really want to waste any bullets. Gotta be another way. Ah, you can only dent it. Right. As Ali says, there must be another way in somehow. To watch for crawl spaces as well. I tend to miss them sometimes. The door there, but it's clearly blocked. See anything down below, so it had to be above us. Not sure whether we're gonna fall through this, aren't we? It's already got a little dent in it. Never mind. That's what we don't want our tar our torch going. through a different part. showing up on the focus but sometimes that doesn't mean a lot it's like a surgery or something god what the fuck happened here somebody's hurt or somebody had something done to them can upgrade something. I must be Molotov. Perfect. And craft a stun bomb, but I. Must... What does that you? Yeah, okay. We'll do one of them just in case I ever do want to use them, but I don't tend to, to bother using them. I don't think they're great. Trap mines, though, I have to say, are a very handy addition to this game if you can just get it in the right place at the right time. Perfect. Perfect. 
Das war echt. doesn't want me to go. I just get a bad feeling that this is the proper way to go, so I'm gonna go back into this room and look first before I open that door. I don't know how many times throughout this series, the first and second game, I've got that wrong, but... Well... Got a bag there, we'll look at that in a second. Another door. Locked, of course. Looks like we got some sort of sleeping quarters here. Alright, let's have a look. Oh, oh. No. oh Owen was the guy okay. from um, when we first saw Abby at the start of the game. He was walking with Abby. That was when we got to play as Abby. His so own was a firefly. Uh, things are starting to go together now. Yeah. I'm not quite sure who the leader is. I think they've mentioned this Isaac person, but from what we saw of Owen, he definitely he definitely looks like somebody if maybe he's not the leader, but sort of like a I don't even know how to put it, like a supervisor, a leader of a group, if you get me. He was clearly a firefly. And we know full well that, as Joel in the first game, we killed a lot of them. And of course, we killed Marlene as well. So, I've said before, I have my theories, but I'm wondering, was like Abby related to Marlene? We, you know, Joel did kill her sort of off screen. We didn't, we saw them after the fact like a flashback but there had to have been a reason for why Abby did what she did and did it the way she did it as well was the thing she absolutely brutalized Joel before he died oh. People don't come back on their island. Mel we saw her in the room as well she chose this I'm not fucking going there then don't go back Hands up. Where's Abby? <clears throat> You're that girl from Jax? Tell me where she went. How do we know you won't kill us? You give her what she you wants. We're dead. You guys can survive this. I just need her. Bullshit. Get over here. Point to where she is on this map. And then you. It better fucking match up. Okay. What are you doing? She's probably dead anyway. It is not worth it. Stop! We can talk Back about it. Back the fuck up! To where she is. Fucking That's right, Owen mentioned it. Oh. Jesus. I was just thinking about that. Owen mentioned at the start that somebody was pregnant. 
I remember no one saying at the start of the game to Abby that somebody was pregnant, I just couldn't remember who it was. Fucking know now, innit? We know the hard way. Wow, that was rough. show it there actually we went off screen I wonder did Owen die as well there shot him and it looked like he shot him quite high up in the chest but All right, let's go speak to Tommy we eventually have seen him This whole area be thawed. Where are you going? Needed some air. What are you guys doing up? Couldn't sleep. <laughs> Come take a look at this. Thought is to head home via Ellenburg. We're in Fall City by tomorrow. We're doing good. Hey. They got what they deserved. On, she gets to live. I would agree with him, but I don't agree with a pregnant lady. Now, come on, Jesus, fucking hell. Is that okay? It has to be. Mm. I'm really not looking forward to going through Idaho again. What you should be worried about is what Maria's gonna do to you when we get home. Yes, Maria. I've been through worse. I think, uh... However, as I was passing through some ritzy section of town, I come across this necklace. It sparkles a lot. I think it's real gold. Peace off, her. It's real <laughs> Yeah, I think gold. I'd rather take my chances with the infected rather than Maria. She seems, uh... I know what gold looks like. Like a scary proposition. If it's legit, can we say it's from all of us? Ha! You find your own damn bribes. Jesse. How you doing? Fine. Barely. Fine. Thanks for coming back for me. My friend's problems are my problems. <laughs> You're such a sap. <laughs> All right, how about uh, my friends can't get out of their own damn way? It's better. Shoot this one too. Don't you do it, Ellie. Get out of here. Stand up now. Don't you fucking dare. Shut the fuck up. Fuck. All right. Stop. Stop. Toss your weapon. Toss 
lost your weapon. Fuck. No, no. I know why you killed Joel. He did what he did to save me. There is no cure because of me. I am the one that you want. Just let him go. Oh, is that it? Is it a cure? You killed my friends. We let you both live. And you wasted it. Miss Abby and Jesus. Four years earlier. Dad. So this. Four years. Yeah, this this would have been during the events of the first game then. Okay. I mean, I don't know whether I've said it before, but I don't think anything we do as Abby is gonna make me forgive her for killing Joel. It's just. I don't think so, Anya. Yeah. But let's see what's going on here. This was not what I expected. I didn't expect to be playing as Abby again, I have to say. <laughs> Dad, come on! You can't keep doing this. Seem to be a similar age as well, Abby and Ellie, I presume. Well, Ellie is 18 at, the, at this point, so... She was 14 in the first game, which is pretty much where we are now. I think four years earlier matches up with the first game. Where the hell are we going? It's easy to get lost in this game sometimes, I have to say. I know where I did jump Dad! over a tree, but looks like that was a different one. Where are you? So we're obviously going to see something here in this little section that uh, might explain things. I always seem to think that it's because of the cure thing that um, that Abby killed Joel, but that. Uh, I don't think it's as simple as that, to be honest. I don't think it's as simple as that. this door there dad footprints okay. Jesus every door is locked for this fence. not going that way anyway we've got barbed wire all over the fence One thing I'm curious of is, uh, are there plans for Naughty Dog to make more Last of Us games? I'm afraid to search ending up about a potential sequel because I've, uh, I've done well to avoid spoilers. As I've said before, the first game came out nearly 10 years ago. The last one, this game, in 2020, and I knew pretty much nothing about any of them, which uh, I was surprised about. So I'm very rare. I'm... Very afraid of looking up Benton that would uh, potentially spoil something for me, but I will definitely be having a read once we uh, finish up this game. Yeah, there's a window in the bathroom here. I'm wondering, can we break that and then climb up? Is that why it gave me a bottle? Now 
do nicely. I get through here. Maybe I can get onto the roof. Pull one of these. There we go. Look at that. Virginia. 1978. 1978. What point is it now in the game? Go back four years, 20 years, <laughs> jump from the start, is not it? So it's 2033 at this point. Okay. There. I think I think that's right, Anya. The first game jumped forward uh, 20 years, I think, after the opening scene. Smooth, Abby. It's a rough landing. You there, sweetheart. So do you. Where? Right there. Oh. You know, every time you run off like this, they give me shit about it. Come on. Believe it or not, they actually care about your safety. These woods are safe. Dad. Abs. She's been hanging out right on the other side of those trees. And? She's due any day now. We'll just check on her and then, and then we'll head back. I promise. Let's just make it quick. The sir dad, I take it. See? Cherry. I've got my little girl to keep me safe. I don't think we've seen him before. How do you know I was here? Owen ratted me out, didn't he? He did his job. How'd you get him to talk? Uh, I asked. Huh. She probably cut through the playground. Hey, look what I found. Oh, wow. 1978. Don't have that one in my collection. You can keep it. If you promise not to pull anything like this again. <laughs> you got yourself a deal. Why don't I believe you? No reason I could think of. Come on. Let's keep looking. Dad. Relax. You'll be back with Owen before you know it. Wait, what? Nothing. Just... Noticed you two have been hanging out a lot. More so than usual. Oh, God. How long have you known? I'm your dad. I see things. Like the way you both try really, really hard not to look at each other when you're around me. You get all serious. It's very cute. I can't handle this. And he makes you laugh. <laughs> That's because he's such an idiot. I just like how he's extra nice to me now. He gets all nervous when he has to keep me in check. So you're taking advantage of him? Me? Never. So they must be fireflies then at this stage because, <coughs> excuse me, Owen had the, uh, yeah, we so found right. Owen's badge, firefly badge. Fresh tracks. Wait. What are we following? This is just your sneaky way of giving me a tracking lesson, isn't it? Must I be an know. animal or something. Is it working? Well, I mean, I found you. Is that a horse or yeah. something? Yeah. You cheated. You do what you need to do to get it done. Wow. You actually listen. You have your moments of wisdom. Hmm. Let's see if we can find anything else. Like I said, as Joel in the first game, we killed a lot of fireflies, but this guy doesn't ring a bell. Obviously, Marlene was the one that stood out. See anything Ooh, else? I wonder if Marlene, his Not wife, yet. and Abby's mother, could Keep that looking. be the connection? I don't know. Where are we going now? Jesus. What the hell is that? Uh, Dad, I found... Something. something, yeah, something. Oh my god. She already gave birth. Ew. And look, two sets of tracks. Dad? It's her. Let's go. That doesn't sound good. No, she's in pain. Abs. I don't even know what kind of animal would make a noise like that. Matt, wait. What if they're infected around? This area is clear. You know they roam. 
You brought your gun, right? Of course. Then I'm not worried. Oh, shit. Abs. Firefly badge again. Uh, yeah. right. You got her tight? Uh, yeah. All right. Get in there, Epson. Get steady. Jesus, the wires really went through it, didn't it? Poor thing. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Everybody's looking for you. We got it. Hey, wait! Dad! What's going on? Come on! Hmm. We did good back there. Uh, the little one, though. That girl showed up. What girl? The one Marlene keeps talking about. They found her in the tunnels. She has an old bite mark on her arm. No signs of infection. That, that can't be. They're already running tests on her, but you gotta get down there. I saw St. Mary's Hospital in the background, which is, I think, where we had the uh, the first game end. Come on. Yeah, there it is. There, yeah. Right. Please don't end there. I want more answers. Here we go. It's intertwined with the brain. There's no other option. There has to be some other way. There's no way to remove the specimen without destroying the host. The host? She's a child, not some petri dish. You think I don't... I'm aware of the situation. And you're okay with killing her? No, I'm okay with developing a vaccine that'll help save millions of lives. How many fireflies have died for less? That was their choice. me are you telling me this is how it's gonna be i am begging you to buy in and what if this was abby <laughs> look everything that we've been fighting for all the sacrifices all of the horrific all of that is justified with this one act if this was your daughter what would you do Happy. I buy some dinner. Thank you, sweetheart. Look, Marlene. Do it. Thank you. I'm gonna go tell Joel. Why? He has a right to know. Good luck with your surgery. I just twigged it. Just twigged it. You're doing the right thing. Yeah. If it was me. I want you to do the surgery.
Yep. I said a minute or two ago I twigged it. When we went into this room at the end of the first game, there was uh, a number of doctors. I think you had to kill one of them. The rest was choice. You didn't have to kill them, but I think the one that we had to was... It's Abby's dad. I have to say, this is brilliant the way they've, they've mixed in both games together. This is... Brilliant. You still in the fucking building? Yeah. No! Don't Dad! Dad! No! No! I said there was nothing she would do that would make me forgive her for killing Joel, but I kind of understand now why. Joel, get up. Joel, fucking get up. Fuck, we don't have to relive this again, do we? Please stop. Please stop. Joel, please get up. No! 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 Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Lenny. Lenny, no. No, no, no. We're here for him. That's it. It's too risky to leave them alive. Too fucking bad. He's right. We can't have loose ends. We killed them. We're no better than he was. They didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, look at my face. Fuck your face. You should be guarding the upstairs like I told you to. Move! Back up. Calm down. Or what? Back the fuck up! Calm down! Darden! You shoot me? Stop! Done. Abby. <gasps> oh, easy. You okay, Abs? Yeah, I just... What's up? Been searching everywhere for you. We've been called up. Isaac wants us at the front. What? Are you serious? I'm afraid so. We should hustle. We're leaving now? <laughs> yes. I'm on us. Okay. My neck. Hey, I didn't particularly want to play his Abby yeah, again, but we're gonna have to. Cook chick? Nah, the weather chick. She's down from the mountain. Oh, the scientist. Nice. Nah, uh, she's a little too excited about her job. Talk my ears off about some storm and. Got a fucking full scale gym in there though? and everything. Oh, absolutely. I can die happy now. <laughs> you should. You're never gonna do better than her. <laughs> I keep thinking the same thing. So whereabouts are we in terms of the timeline now? That's at Seattle day one. Whereas when we were playing as Ali, it was day three we were at. Please look at all the kids as well. Hello, Miss Potts. Hello, Nanny. Oh. Her too. A gentleman never tells. <laughs> wow. It's like a little school they've got going here. Play, learn, and grow. I gotta talk to my dad for a second. Grab us some food? Yeah, on it. Get me something con picante. You get what you get. Jesus, how many of them is there? What do you got? Another one with a 
PSV to buy the it. It's nice to see you too, Abby. Oh shit, Jordan. I didn't see you there. You coming with us to the Saravina? Uh, Manny and I just got called up to the FOB. What are you doing at the Saravina? Hotel and the school are getting evacuated. We're grabbing supplies and bringing everyone back to the base. I know that Seriously? voice as well. Yeah, can you fucking believe after everything we're falling back? You don't know that's what it is. Uh, at least Leah might be home from the TV station sooner. Well, there's that, yeah. Leah. Oh, that was the girl that was killed at the TV station, and actually. So yeah, this is back to... Yeah. I think we were on day three or four with Ali, so we're just gone back to the beginning. I think that voice actor of this guy, Jordan, I think he voices young Sam Drake in uh, Uncharted 4. It sounds very similar, and yeah. Hey, sir. Ah, Excuse Abby. Me. How you feeling? Fantastic. Would you please tell him to get rid of this? Oh, I've tried. <laughs> I look good. Te ves horrible. <laughs> bueno, we have to head out. Keep him safe. <laughs> For you, I will. Can we just skip the queue to get the food we need? Or do we have to queue as well? What are they serving today? Burritos. Again. Okay. Abby, what are you doing? Hey, tenemos prisa, dame tres burritos. Hey man, there's a line. Kitty, what the fuck? Excuse me. Wait your turn like the rest Sorry. of us. Sorry. We're going to the front. Come on. <sighs> so embarrassing. Why do you have three? Pull them back. Now don't freak out. Mel's coming with us. Manny? Where's your pack? In the room? Why are you doing this to me? Because I care about both of you. And I'm tired of all the bullshit. Does she know I'm on this drive? She does. And she's cool with it? Yeah. <laughs> Why does your yeah sound like a no? <laughs> it's my accent. Come on, stop being paranoid. He looks, he looks like the one who spit at Joel after Joel was killed, so... If it is him, can't say I have much time for him. <laughs> I think you get a kick out of making me uncomfortable. No. It's an opportunity for you two to finally move forward. We've barely said a word to each other since Jackson. I'm just supposed to pretend that didn't happen? Of course not. You guys need to talk about it. She wanted Joel dead as much as the rest of us. But she's not like the rest of us. She hasn't hurt people like that before. She, she kills scars all the time. Not the way we kill Joe. Don't forget, we are grunts. She's a medic. Come on, Abby. She's family. Do it for me, okay? I'll try. That's all I'm asking. Get your things ready. I'm gonna grab mail. Yeah. Be nice. Bye. Me. Jesus, what is this? Like a football stadium or something? Test, huh? Huh. Knock, knock. Ready to roll? Yeah, just about. I cleared you for active duty. Barely. You could probably get a stay if you ask. I'd rather not sit around if I don't have to. And Owen's okay with this? Why would it be up to Owen? We need to grab Alice on our way. Hey. Do better.
What are you getting called up for? Soundview Stadium. Hey, uh, when you get back, will you check on my dad? He seems, uh, I don't know, worse. Worse how? Well, he's complaining about a sharp pain in his wrist. He can barely hold a spoon. Maybe we can get him some more painkillers. Heard they moved you and Owen to Section 96? Yeah, it's, it's nice. It's lots of young families. Getting you guys excited about the baby. Seeing all the kids running around, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting ready. <laughs> all those crying babies. Let's drive Owen crazy. He hasn't even seen it yet. He's out on rotation with Danny. Danny? Yikes. Sucks for him. Yeah. Great. Abby, you want to grab her? Oh, Alice is the dog. Hey, girl. German Shepherd. Hey, you crazy dog. Used to have a German I Shepherd, actually, when girl. I was younger. The only one that'll put up with your shit. <laughs> Don't be jealous. Hey, Al. You want to go to the trucks? Let's go to the trucks. Looks like a German Shepherd, isn't it? I'm not saying I'm mistaken. Bear. Yeah, okay, since you asked so nicely. <laughs> Who's the best boy? Yeah. Gotta get going, pooch. Did I see you with Jen last night? Yes, you did. You dirty dog. What's she doing in town? Something for Isaac. <laughs> it's gotta be a lonely job. She really likes it. Ask her about the cumulus dog. <laughs> well, I guess you get to stay away from the combat. Yeah, I, that's what you're into. Hey, I'll be Abby. Staying put, I think. Hey, uh, just treating families. You admit fucking up scars. I don't think so. Hey, Pat. Hey. Hey, Pat. Can I have my usual? You got it. Gracias. Which trucks are in? Take S24. I'm driving. <sighs> Sign us out. Pale. Thanks. May your survival be long. May your death be swift. <laughs> I could use a warm up. For some friendly competition, the loser cleans the apartment. Mm, high stakes. Best score on a full magazine. You're on, cabron. Bit of a shooting contest going on. Back to beat him, but he destroyed me. I like my blanket tucked in tight. Oh, God damn it. We didn't say when I have to clean. Don't be a sore loser. Let's go. Shouldn't even take the earmuffs off. Oh, Let's no, get to the base. <laughs> More ammo if you do need it. Yes, we need it. Gun, actually, whatever it is. Yeah. Yeah. Alice hmm. gets shotgun. Mel's pregnant. <laughs> she could use the fresh air. Give you two a chance to talk. Well, son, man.
still can't believe Kelly killed Mel. Gracias. I mean, I wouldn't call her exactly innocent and sleeping everything, days? but compared to the rest of them, she doesn't seem quite as bad. Do you want me to get you something from the pharmacy? Or? Nah, I'm, I'm good. It's not a big deal. No, it's, it's fine. I'm just gonna wear myself out. I've been picking up a few extra assignments. You and I. What do you mean? Nothing. Hey, Manny. Where are you headed? Two. Truck S24 headed to two. May your survival be long. May your dead be sweet. Is that like their motto or something? Maybe we lost a hatchery. Yeah. Any plan on getting it back? Nah, Isaac says it's low priority. We're fishing enough wild salmon right now. What did you mean about me and Owen? Um... I haven't seen him in like two weeks. Keeps picking up open assignments. Has he talked to you? Did did he say anything? Or... No, we're still not. I mean, I, I seen him in the mess hall, but we walk around each other. Jackson shook him. You know, I wouldn't read too much into it. Oh shit! Ambush! Hang on! No, stay low. Kill the wolf! They were waiting for us. What the fuck you think we're doing? In the fob. It's a hike. We're too exposed. Let's get inside. Let's make sure this place is secure. Places to hide in here. Guys, I got company. Infected.
Explodes after a short what? delay. Crafts two bombs. Nice. Guys, look up there. See the light coming through? Could be a way out. I'll climb up there and check it out. Here we go. Shamblers are not nice, but they are so Shit. easy to take down compared to the bloater. It's unbelievable. Can we say fuck this place? Yes. Fuck this place. <laughs> Come on. Alright guys, so that's where I'm going to end this 14th part, uh, and an unbelievable part really, that was that was amazing, I think that's the, my favourite part so far, that was unbelievable, uh, we got our answers, we now know why Abby killed Joel, I still, I still don't forgive her, and I still have mixed feelings about having to play as her in the game, but I at least now understand why she did what she did, but... Yeah, I, I think the interaction there, I mentioned it between the first and second game there. I think that was brilliant, the way Naughty Dog did it. It was just unbelievable, you know, Abby being in the building at the time when Joel was rescuing Ellie and in the end killing her dad. I mentioned, you know, I was skeptical at the end of the first game whether we had to kill any of the doctors in the room that time. But obviously we now know that we did have to kill that one doctor, Jerry, Abby's dad. So yeah, brilliant interaction between the first and second game. Um, the bit where Mel was killed, that was rough, I have to say. I uh, I knew somebody was pregnant. I just wasn't quite sure it was her until until Owen said it. We have to wait and see as well to see is he alive. He's alive at this point where we're playing now, but we're gone back a little bit in time once again. That those sort of jumps back are brilliant as well because they tie in so much of the story it's just yeah this game is it's just unbelievable i'm i'm loving it so much and uh, i hope you're enjoying my playthrough of it make sure to hit that like button down below as hard as you possibly can uh, subscribe as well if you are new to my channel and make sure you hit the bell so you uh, you never miss any of my uploads and uh, yeah we'll be back again for part 15 very very soon peace out